It is in the old times called azurine. These terms, it is called copper. You have a great imbalance already in your body physical of this mineral. And azurine did many wondrous things to the body, to the skin, in particular to the brain, and was genetically what preserved the entities as a perfected being and allowed them longevity in the body physical. In other words, with a harmoniously balanced body, there was no physical decay. Hence, peoples of these times lived thousands of years. Copper in the body works, as it were, in the hemoglobin, or what you call blood. And in that hemoglobin allows the binding, works its way up into the brain, flushes the brain and its cells with copper-rich blood. This fires the nerves and the neuron activity with a flushing. When there is copper present in the cells, in the brain, you have an expedient brain that you are full of wit and cleverness. You can pick up thought readily. You can pick up thought from the other side of the universe because it is a clear frequency. That copper changes the electromagnetic field in the cell that is dominated by iron and resists radioactivity.